hello crypto enthusiasts it's your boy daniel and i'm back with another new video today if you're new to the channel be rest assured that the future of money is here in today's video i'm going to be teaching you how to link your metamask wallet to the open x long testnet right and i'm also going to be teaching you how to get free usdt from the open x long testnet faucet okay so pay close attention and do not skip any part of this video because what i'll be explaining to you today is going to be well detailed and well understandable so we're just going to click that drop down arrow right there to select account 2 because account 2 is what we'll be using for the purpose of this tutorial so we have switched to the account 2 and as you can see right here the only thing we have here is core network all right the core network and that's because i have call in my account one now any network you add will reflect in all accounts so the first thing for us um what we're meant to do right now is to click on that browser section and um, the first link we're meant to copy is the agx link which is the faucet url all right you can get that in my telegram group all right i'll leave a link in the description a link that says link for oex testnet faucet claim so once you copy that link head back to the d app section of your metamax wallet then click on the browser section and paste in that link and then click on search so once you do that you would arrive at this page that looks exactly like this now the first thing you meant to do is to click on add call network i'm explaining this so that even a newbie will be able to follow up the moment you click on add call network you'll be asked to switch between the ethereum to the core yeah because if you're a newbie who haven't mind call you won't have the core network in your metamax account always so you have to switch from ethereum to call all right so you just have to click on switch network now the moment you do that you will automatically switch to the core network as you can see right here the core is now active and yes after doing this you're meant to see the core appear in your wallet exactly like this so you switched from the ethereum main network to the core network now if we head back to our telegram group right here what you're meant to do right now is copy the scan dot long url which is the explorer url so just copy that and head back to the d app section of your metamax wallet at the moment you head there just click on the tab section and once you click on the tab just click on the plus icon right there and a new tab would be opened up once the new tab opens up just go to the search section and paste in that link and then click on search the moment that is done you would arrive at this page which says scan along dot open x network as you can see right here you um, a lot of transaction has been going on so just scroll down to the very bottom and you see this very um button that says add open x long testnet you're meant to click on that very button now you're going to see this error message which says unregistered or unrecognized chain id and that's because we haven't added the open x long testnet in our wallet so how do we do this you just have to click the faucet url which is a tab you just opened up just click the faucet url click on connect web 3 this time around now the moment you click on connect web 3 this will show you whether you want to use account one or two we are using account two for the purpose of this tutorial so just go ahead and click on connect and then you're going to see this a whole of this option which just appeared first one says clean testnet usdt add long testnet usdt testnet explorer testnet swap the one you're meant to click on is the one that says add long testnet and after that you go ahead and click on confirm then click on switch network and automatically the open next long test net will now be active in your metamax wallet so just head back to let's just click on the wallet section right now and as you can see right there we now have the usdt and at the top you see open x long test net mind you this is just for testing purposes this is not the real open x token so let's head back to the faucet url and click on claim test net usdt now the moment you click on claim test net usdt this would start to process okay and right here it says total claim cancel gas fee required to interact with contract address so you need some call to cover up for gas fees okay because you can claim this without gas fees so how do you do that let's just head back to our wallet and then i'm going to switch to account one right now so that i'll be able to send call to account two as you can see right here i have zero call and if i click that drop down arrow at the top what you need to know is that for me to be able to claim the openness long test net usdt i will need to have some call in this account note whatever account you are to claim the open x long test USDT in you must have some call to cover up for gas fee in that particular account so i'm going to head to account one right now and i'll do that by clicking on the drop down arrow and selecting account one so i'm going to select the token and then click on send and the moment i click on send uh first off you get to see account listed for you there. so i'm going to select account two and then click on next the moment i click on next i'll be asked to type in the amount i want to send to this account so i'm going to type in 0 0.02 and then click on next 
and as usual we'll be showing the estimated gas fee for this which is 0 0.3006 which is normal so i'm just going to click send and as you can see transaction submitted and transaction complete so to confirm if this arrived in account 2 i'm going to click that um drop down arrow right there and select account 2 and yes we received that 0 0.02 call which is just um about one cent so i'm just going to click the dapp section again and then click close and then click on claim testnet usdt this time to see how it goes as you can see now we are being presented with the gas fee we are meant to pay which is 0 0.3006 so i'm going to click on confirm and as you can see here it says transaction submitted and yes your token was claimed successfully okay your token claim was successfully submitted please wait for about 10 blocks for confirmation so i'm going to head back to my wallet right now click on the drop down arrow at the top which says call then select open x long testnet and then refresh this to see if i actually received the usd we have been given 10 usd for each transaction before but i don't really know how many it would be right now um i had some news it's now one let me see for myself so let's try this let's keep refreshing and see if this would pop up so after much trying and trying it didn't work i don't know why it didn't work maybe i'm meant to wait for 24 hours but right now i'm in the account one and i'm going to, and I'm going to try to claim this using the account one so i'm going to head to the dr section and then click on that icon at the top right hand corner of my screen to change the network to account one then click connect web3 wallets and then click on switch network okay yeah the open x long test net okay i'm going to click on switch network now and then click on claim testnet usdt and as you can see right now it's it has started processing and we're just going to wait for it a little bit and as you can see we are being given the estimated gas fee which is 0 0.3006 which is very little okay so if you have like 0 0.1 core you have enough to cover for gas fees so i'm just going to go ahead and click on confirm and my transaction will be submitted and once it's done processing you'll see this um information that would be presented on your screen which says your token claim was successfully submitted please wait for about 10 blocks for confirmation so i'm going to go back to my wallet by clicking on that icon at the bottom left hand corner of my screen and then click on the call icon at the top of my screen and switch to open next long test next okay let's see how that goes so i'm going to go ahead and refresh this to see whether we actually received this in our wallets so as you can see we successfully received the one testnet usdt note this is not real usdt now i'm going to go back to my browser station to claim more of this now you have to do this continuously to be able to get as much as you want so i'll just click on switch network right now and carry on the same process over again by clicking on claim testnet usdt and then you start processing and then once we see we have been presented with the gas fee all i have to do is click on confirm and my um transaction will be submitted and the process would complete okay as you can see my token claim was successfully submitted again so i'll have to wait for about 10 blocks for confirmation i don't really know why it didn't work in the account too that is my second account in my metamask wallet but it's working perfectly well right here which is um the account one so in case you don't know gas fees are paid to crypto miners who process transaction on the network now metamask does not profit from gas fees okay gas fees are set by the network and fluctuate based on network traffic and transaction complexity so that's how it works so i'm just going to take a break skip this video and come up when i've accumulated enough this should also be an opportunity for you to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on important updates like this so after doing this a couple of times on the account one i finally decided to use the account one for the purpose of this video so we are going to be using account account one for this and no longer account Two. so what i'm meant to do right now is to click on the dapp section which is the browser section as you can see right there we have our 12 usdt at the top just, just click on the dapp section right now and we're going to be opening a tab which is the second tab we opened which is the explorer url all right so we are, what we're meant to do right now is to go back to the explorer url and click on add open x long test nets all right the reason we're going to do this is so that every transaction we carry out would appear on the scan explorer okay this is actually the testnet everything we are doing here is actually for testing purposes and nothing is real you can't sell any of this token because we haven't really gotten to the main net so after doing that i'm just going to clear all those tabs i cleared all those tabs so i'm um, just click on a new tab right now i'm going to be leaving you the tabs we are meant to be using for this now go back to my telegram group like i said before the link will be in the description so just click on the one that says long swap um open x network so that's the swap interface url so just copy that link right now and once that link is copied come back to metamask browser and click on the browser section click on the search section and then click paste okay once you paste that 
enter it in the keyboard like search for that and you would appear in the swap interface right here as you can see right here it looks um like pancake swap has a similar feel what we're meant to do right now is to connect our wallet that's the first thing in crypto before you be able to do anything you have to do some connection okay we're going to be swapping our usdt to oex okay you're going to see how we're going to be doing that so just click on connect so the moment you click connect the next thing you're meant to do is click on metamax and then go ahead and click on connect of course we're going to be using account one so there will be no switching the moment you click on connect automatically you see that that wallet has been connected right there all right connected and active so if you want to disconnect if you intend to disconnect it you just have to click on that wallet again and then click disconnect it is that simple so we're going to be swapping usdt right here to oex but first we need to have the oex token in our wallet i'm going to click on 25 percent right now because i want to spend 25 percent of my token all right to swap to the oex and um, as you can see 25 percent right here is 2.99 dollars what i'll be getting is 0. For OES token, and that's because one OES token is actually valued at six point three dollars. This is not actually the real monetary value. This is just test net price, but it has the potential to get to this. So to swap or to add the OES token to my MetaMask wallet, I have to click on that tiny MetaMask icon next to the OES token, and then click on Add Token. Okay, it's that simple. The moment you do this, simply go back to your wallet to confirm, and that's it right there. The OES token by the sitting in our wallet so right now we can go back to the swap section and then carry on with the swapping so i'm going to click on swap right now as you can see for yourself i'll be swapping 2.99 usdt that's testnet usdt for 0.4 oex token and while you're doing this you have to note that the price changes over time so you just have to click on accept all right once you click on accept you click on confirm swap immediately and the swapping process will begin the next screen, as always, will lead you to the page where you'll be showing the estimated gas fee. Um, you don't have to worry about your call because this gas fee will not be charged in call, rather USDT. Okay, so right now what you're meant to do is to click on confirm and um, the swapping would begin fully. And as you can see, transaction submitted and transaction complete. So what we're meant to do right now is to head back to our wallet to confirm if this actually went through. And yeah, as you can see, there's a decision of 3 USDT right there. And I can see my open OEX token, uh, which is the 0.4 OES testnet token. All right. If you don't see yours immediately, you just have to reload that. All right. Just refresh the screen and you get to see yours. For 25% of the money I have right here, I'll be getting 0.3 OES token for 50%, 0.7 OES token for 75%, 1 OES token and max is 1.4. OES token and um, like I said before one OES token is worth 6.3 USDT for you to add other tokens to your wallet all you have to do is to click on the, the OES token icon right there and you'll be able to see other tokens you can add to your wallet which are all test tokens okay the uh, drop down arrow right here is the arrow that enables you to switch between tokens okay or between cryptocurrencies right if I were to um, switch from OEX to USDT I would just have to click on enable OEX and um begin the swapping process right if i click enable oex i'll be asked to fix our set spending cap request but i don't do that so i'll just x out of that now we're back to um the faucet all right um if i want to replace the usdt I lost i just have to click on clean testnet usdt it just begin to process i'll just confirm and the transaction will be submitted and completed okay and i will just receive my tokens back it's that simple right you just have to go through the video over and over again and you get the whole process it's that simple so let me just refresh this right now and you see that i've um, i've gotten one testnet usdt back and as you can see right there and i have 10 usdt which is actually not real money testnet usdt you can transfer this for real money so that's it guys that's um the major thing i want you to learn about in this very video so heading back to my telegram group right here i'm going to leave a link in the description which says um links for oes testnet for set claim you're going to see that link in the description of the video uh that's it that is the link that will redirect you to this telegram post okay as you can see this is where i got the links all the links you see right here this is the official tweet by the openx team okay and um so the three links we use in this video are the scan long which is the explorer url the swapping interface url the faucet url and the last which we didn't use actually which i'll be using in consequent videos or the videos come with the free faucet link all right i'm going to teach you how to do that if you enjoyed this video leave a like um if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on important information like this
For those of us who want to partake in the OpenX long testnet USDT claim, I'll be sending you some call to cover up for gas fee. So just drop a nice comment and your call address and I'll send you some call just enough to cover up for gas fees. Also join our small social media community using the link in the description for a quicker update. I'm your crypto guide Daniel Patrick and I'll see you in our next video. Stay safe.